Welcome back to Sebwems, everybody. Praise be to God on this incredible day. So continuing with the Stormy rank, we should finish the rank today, or at least this recording session, I'm determined, because we only have five levels left. We're on level 16, Wild Forever. This is like the first rock level we've seen in in the entire pack, maybe? I feel like there I feel like Flopsy does not really use the rock tile set all that much. Anywho, we can kill three lemmings. Gee, wonder where we're gonna have to kill the lemmings. Knew it. I knew the lizard was gonna eat them if they fall down that crack. That's probably also Splite. No, that's not Splite. Alright. Hmm, interesting. One of them actually turned... really? Wait, what? Free? Really? Alright, let's work backwards, shall we? One destructive skill there, and they go to the exit. We can use this destructive skill there. for that. Hmm. This seems much trickier than I anticipated. If we bunch them all together here, then we can drop them all down and he'll only eat a couple. Okay, clearly we're going to need to build and mine through all of this. Oh wait, actually this shouldn't be too bad. As long as I can find a way to hold these guys in at the beginning. There we go. No. No, I said platform. Did not want both the climbers to die, that's a no-no. Booyah. One gets through. Wait a second, that's not gonna work out. New idea! Ha ha ha, there we go.
So now my plan was... Hold these guys down. Except that's going to lose too many lemmings. There's a way to keep... Hmm. New plan. We're gonna let five lemmings go ahead. How did he fall through? Fine. One, two, three. Turn it back to 95. Then minimize. There we go. There we go. So then that guy's going to die. But I don't think that should be a big problem. Actually, it might be a big problem if he does die. That's why we're going to do that. We can max out the release right now. That keeps them nice and hemmed in. Do, 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 do. Was that a trap down there? That's a trap down there. That's a bother. Someone tells me that is woefully off center. that to test where to mine from. Well, that's actually completely not going to work. I just want to see if that's going to work. I'm pretty sure that's not going to work. In fact, I'm just going to go on and flat out say that's not going to work. the other side. Okay, I gotta send him up way sooner than that. That looks a bit better. Alright. Darn it. Let's see if holding off on the floater will do the trick.
That should speed him up a good amount. That's not enough. I still have to send them out sooner. I feel like this is too soon, though. Maybe not. Maybe they'll swap places and that'll give me enough time. Bridge has got to go higher up. too close to the edge. This is one of those levels where I can see the tricks needed pretty easily. It's just a matter of doing them exactly right. down. How do I make that bridge up higher, though? Do I really have to dig through all that just to get it perfectly? I do have a... If so, then that's going to be a bobber, because... I'm going to have to find out a way to save one of the lemmings. see any way to save these guys, though. I can't even make him climb up the wall to stall, because that just means he's going to still climb up over the stacker at the edge. I suppose there's one thing I could try. Still being a jerk. Two, three, let's turn it. Why? Okay, this is re this is dumb. We need to sacrifice two lemmings to get down there.
Unless we really do have to mesh all the lemmings together. Except that's still gonna lose two lemmings. Maybe. That's not gonna work. So I know you gotta do dig, build, build, mine for all of that. But I can't see any way to save the lemmings, because you need to sacrifice two lemmings in order to get through there, unless you can really squish them together, but I don't see much way to do that. I still don't know why the Iguana Trap is so fast. Oh my gosh, are you serious? Does that push them just close enough together? Yes, it does! That uses up one of our floaters, which is not good, but I think we can manage. Pretty far down, I don't like that. <sighs> Maybe a bit farther forward. Yeah, this is all just coming down to perfectly precise positioning. I don't like the floater trick at the beginning. Alright, so that that one is too high up. It's gotta go down lower. 
Maybe the grass is like a marking? Why do you know, like, hey, you should build here? close together now. We'll just have to wait and see. Yeah, they're too close together. Dunk on it. I don't even know if this is going to line up properly. Whoa, that's close together. How did they get so close together? Tell me that's too close. Still too high up, really. Oh my. I feel like I should cut out most of this because it's just me fiddling around until I get exactly the pixel perfect timing. And now it's too low. By the way, this mountain is not red enough to warrant the music Red Mountain. You see, like, I had to restart everything just because I was one pixel too high. And it's impossible to tell how high or low you're gonna be until you've already discovered it. we go. Good grief. He better hit steel. Good. If he didn't hit steel, he would have died. Alright, that level was cool in concept, but way too precise and fiddly. So you can move that back, or you could change it to make it easier to tell where you need to build from in each part. Alright, level 17, futuristic climber zone. Oh no, not the space tile set. <sighs> oh no, not teleporters. And stack. Wow, this is terrible. And they're coming from two directions. Where is even the exit? Okay, the exit's there. Hmm. 
So that is something we could stack over, okay. Platformer, platformer, platformer. So where are these guys going to try to go? This way. I feel like that side's gonna need the blocker more. Oh, we have a disarmor. That's gonna be your job, dude. Maybe we could use a stacker for the exit area. I hope so. Oh no, you're not supposed to do that. We don't even need to go up there, we just need to go on this bottom part. It was sure was nice of Flopsy to put these little things down there for us to catch ourselves with. Six platformers left. We're going to need one, two, three, four, five. So we, okay. Thank 
Alright, this is an interesting level, and this is probably the best space level I've ever seen. I just don't like the space tile set. No. You are a fool. And we're still going to need one stacker there, so maybe we could spare a stacker. Oh, it sends them both ways. Interesting. Ooh, that's a pretty one. That is not. Well, that's a bit of a bobber. How are we going to stop that? How could we spare a platformer? Hmm. How could we spare a platformer? Maybe... And there's no real way to hold these guys back. Or you would pretty much need the blocker to hold these guys back. Because we can't put the blocker there. I don't think so, at least. Let me see if we could. Yeah, I feel like we need the blocker to hold these guys back. As useful as it would be there. We could stack and then platform perfectly like that. Maybe. Sure, we could. Get ready for a great show. I'm not liking how most levels are requiring the release rate to be manipulated precisely. But it's okay, it's a simple enough trick. I just feel like there's much more you could explore. Now this way, this guy gets a big head start, and we can save a stacker. And what was I going to use the stacker for? Oh, that's right. No, 
now it's just a question of guesstimating the platformer's length. A bit farther back. Just a little bit farther back. That's a clever level. Oh, what? Why? Are we gonna have to perfectly time the crowd just so we don't have splatters? We sure as heck are. That is not good. Not good design. Because there's always going to be a splatter or a splatter here. Unless we can do something stupid like this. No. Oh, hey, two in a row. Hey, what the heck? That is so annoying. Put a platform there, and a platform there. Yeah, I'm just gonna say that's not good design. Oh, what?! And that's even worse! Why can't we stack to get up? I don't see any way we could use a stacker instead of a platformer. I 
Unless we're just flat out supposed to ignore the teleporter and do a weird feint over here. How many stack? Oh, we only have three stackers. No, that's not gonna work. I was thinking, like, well, we could platform there and stack there. And then we could do a double stack up, but that's totally not going to work. I like my solution better. And for some reason, it canceled my replay. I, feel, I like my solution better than whatever the real solution is. I haven't seen it yet, but I'm just gonna say it. Hmm. I really don't like this here. And I apologize if I feel like I'm coming off super harsh, where I've been like, oh, these levels are all terrible. It's like, no, they're not. They are interesting levels, I just don't particularly like them because of the gimmicks that they use. For example, any level that uses teleporters, like, I'm out, pretty much. Like, here it doesn't bother me as much, because the, this, the in teleporter, it's all protected. It's all protected? Like the lemmings aren't going to kill themselves. But they're just so slow, and teleporters need to be instantaneous. So you need to platform to the exit. That's very dumb. So we absolutely need a platformer for there, and for there, and for there, and for there. That's four platformers. We're, no way about it, we're gonna either need to use all three stackers here, which is not gonna happen, or we need to use a platformer there. Also, no destructive skills, which is very weird. Oh my gosh, you can disarm these. Oh, I'm an idiot. How did I not realize that? That's gonna be how we get across. Okay... That makes sense. The question is, how do we hold these guys back? Oh, sorry, little dude. 
I don't know why I felt thought you couldn't disarm those. Oh, that's not going to do them any good at all. All right, and then there's this doofus. Darn it, but we're gonna need one, two, leaves us with two. Nope, that's too many platformers. We gotta time it like perfectly so that way this guy finishes the bridge, that guy goes for the bridge before he turns around. That don't seem right. Yeah, that's, that's not going to work out. Okay, I am certain you need to do this, though. You gotta hold them back. You gots to. So basically, we either need to have this guy just, no, hang on, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, so we have like one platformer which we can do something with. Alright, let's try something new. It's like Owl says, try a little something new, try a little something different. I can't believe I just quoted a terrible Winnie the Pooh scene alone video. Actually, I kinda can believe it. I can't see any way to do that, though. No, not the disarmer. Oh, I already know this is headed for trouble. Dog freaking gone it, we can't hold these guys in. They're always gonna be running to danger.
I was wondering if there was going to be some way... Wait a second, wait a second. Hmm, that's certainly an option. This is so infuriating. Everything is positioned just in the wrong way so that you can't do anything. Because, like, if you build across there, well, guess what? If you just leave them there, they're all going to splat. Oh, do you want to stack up there? Great! Then they're going to splat fall down there and die. Oh, you build a platform over there? Well, guess what? This guy's going to die. Oh, what's that? You want to stack them in place? Great! They're all going to go into the airlock and die. I've always wondered what would happen if you actually grabbed the pickup skill. When you don't have the skill at your disposal. Actually, you know what? I'm out of ideas, so we're gonna try that. Nothing happens. I mean, I can't really be surprised. <laughs> They're, they are just climbers, yeah, okay. So we could send a lone guy down there. What I think is required is required. This is going to be terrible. And I'm pretty sure what I think is required is required. even keeps them hemmed in. I simultaneously can and can't believe this. Please don't splat from that. Oh, this is just, like, perfect. Oh, my lands. Oh, I now I pretty much can guarantee they are all going to get stuck on the right side of there. Oh, they didn't! Congratulations! You did something right, Flopsy. 
That sounded way meaner than I expected it to. I am so sorry. I even have a stacker left over, so... Back root? Don't care, because my original solution should have worked anyways. <laughs> Woot! At last! 